hopefully you can see me. I just finished working out. Um, I have been being a bad girl for about a week, week and a half, two weeks now. And um, yeah, I just, I just didn't feel good. I didn't feel right. I didn't feel like my body was doing what it's supposed to do, acting the way it's supposed to act. So, and then plus, I want to get rid of this little roundness that I have here. I don't know if I'm going to completely get rid of it because, as I said in my previous video, I had it before I had kids. It was just really, 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 really small. And if it's still there, it's fine. As long as it's really, 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 really small again, then I'm fine with that. So, I guess I just wanted to give you a little update as to where I am. And, um... Uh, Hopefully, I'm going to be more consistent with working out. So, in this, you can see a little bit more. I don't want to show too much because it's not that kind of video. Um, but, as I was explaining before, like my upper abs are extremely small. Extremely small. Um, even when I was pregnant, um, this part of my body didn't get that big. carried out and low, I guess. Um, even though my stomach was huge and like it was coming out from here, like this part of me always stayed small. So that wasn't much of an issue in terms of like, you know, gaining weight up here, it's just down here. And when you're small, like I am, if you have like a little bit of a stomach, it looks bigger than if you're a thicker person with the same little bit of a stomach. Does that make sense? Anyway, plus I know what I am used to looking like and I know what I like to look like. So, you know, there are a lot of people who are like, oh, why are you exercising? You're skinny. You don't need to exercise. Yes, I do. And I will. So, yeah. So this is where I am now. Right? Um, and funny thing, I was just thinking about something. I used to suck in my stomach all the time and now I'm actually pushing it out. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna push it out. Right? This is me pushing out my stomach. And from working out, okay, so if I suck it in, it's like this. I don't know if you can see the difference. If I push it out, like that. From working out it naturally sucks itself in if that makes sense so my posture is better because my abs are stronger my back hurts less like the other day I was shopping and that's what prompted me to start working out again the other day I was shopping and getting back to school stuff for the kids and my two-year-old, she got tired, and we were walking around a lot, and then I picked her up, and I was like, oh, I can't carry you anymore. And she's like 30 pounds. She's not that heavy. And before that, when I was working out consistently, and I would pick her up and carry her, it wouldn't be an issue. So just just to do stuff like that, just to maintain that strength, um, flexibility, I'm getting older, so, you know, I, I need to be fit. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go down kicking and screaming and punching so yeah that's it hope everyone is well um be healthy if you can get on an exercise regimen if it's not something that's dangerous for you do it even if it's just walking if it's just running even if it's one day a week two days a week something you'll feel a lot better and you will look better and you will be better um so it's about nine o'clock I am going to take a shower, wash my hair. I actually think I'm going to do a co-wash today because my hair really isn't dirty, it's just sweaty. Um, eat some oatmeal. I love oatmeal. I make mine with um, peanut butter, crunchy peanut butter because I don't like a lot of milk. Milk makes me not happy. So <laughs> yeah, that's it. I'll talk to you guys soon. Blessings.